smells so good. I could probably honestly eat another one of these. I'm excited for you to try it. This one's not like they didn't put as I much sauce as they normally do. Grilled chicken sandwiches. I don't haven't had a crispy chicken sandwich. I don't even know how long. Am I supposed to eat it in the bag? Like the flight bag? I mean, yeah. It's, 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 oh my god, it's huge. <laughs> I feel like a food blogger. Yeah. <laughs> I'm excited. Come on. Oh, I'm eating it upside down. <laughs> it's Okay, that bite was polished by me. I'm sorry, eating so much. Okay, that one was kind of spicy. Oh my god, it's not even spicy. <laughs> Ninety-one degrees is hot. We hold this. You can just feel that hot. Like it's hot. It's <laughs> recording. It's hot, but it's not that hot. <laughs> Ninety-one degrees, but it must be low humidity. It's hot, but it's not. Today's forecast. I have no idea. It looks like clear skies. Look, clear. It's hot, but it's clear. Not. clear. We We're walking next to the river. The river. Check it us out. Sam's putting up her hair. Just walking, doing her thing. Me and Sam. I pee my hair down because I don't like how it looks up and I'm just gonna worry about sweating. But I'm glad I wore this because it has holes in it so I can sweat. And I'm glad I wore not jeans because I would be so constricted right now. Yeah. I gotta walk to the zoo. I think it's like five minutes down there. Shirt. I can't believe you wore a tiger shirt to go to the zoo. I'm excited to go to the zoo because I haven't been to a zoo besides um, Detroit and Tampa or Jacksonville. Detroit. Either one. I've only been to two different zoos before.
You need to document it then. You're telling me a pig that goes in the wild can turn into a warthog. A road. Tuss. Tuss. A normal farm pig. Yes. He's lying. <laughs> That's embarrassing. My hair right now is embarrassing. I can't believe we paid three dollars for this cup of water. Yours was only like a dollar more than my water. But it's so 90 good. degrees out and it's impossible to not drink anything. It's so hot. This is gonna be our backyard one day. Yeah, I, I hope. <laughs> With this. <laughs> Look at that thing. That's gonna be like, you know when they have the statues at the front, like where your road is? We're gonna have, We're gonna have these little dancing turtle statues. So nice. Look how big that thing goes up. Or tall, I can't speak today. That's my <gasps> or the frog ones. Greenhouse. Oh my god, we'll have all these. We'll have a frog, a turtle, a bunny. <laughs> that one's cool. I like the big rock. Oh my god, that's your favorite one, the big mm -hmm. rock. Yeah. You know, it's definitely better than I thought it was going to be, though. Like, everything's pretty new. Ugh, oh, I love Keurig machines. You what? I wish I could have parked on the roof. What's our view like? Oh. Pretty good. Nothing crazy, but we'll definitely be able to see fireworks all tonight. Since it's the 4th of July. <laughs> the big king size oh, yeah. bed. I know, I keep forgetting. This bed's pretty nice. Chair. I mean, yeah, I guess the bathroom's not anything crazy, but we also don't need anything crazy. I like the lights. Good thing I brought, I already said, good thing I brought clothes for dinner because this is not a dinner outfit. <laughs> but this is cool and you can check out whenever you want. But now we have to always stay at Hilton so we have this app. But you can use it any Hilton thing, it's a Hilton app. Digital key. Stand close to your door to open. Missing the front desk was, I have to say, the best part because it takes forever to do that. And it's a small room, but we don't need much, you just sleep. What are you looking for? <laughs> but the app was definitely the best part of it all.
it's hard to eat. It tastes so good, but it's so hard to use chopsticks. I literally don't know how to use chopsticks. Oh my god, it's so good. <laughs> Am I doing it right? Let's see. Yeah, that's good. <laughs> <laughs> my update is it's very, very good, but incredibly hard to eat. I wish I could just eat it with a fork. My little dinner outfit. This is just a t-shirt dress from Forever 21 from like two years ago. Buttons up. It's kind of like a casual but also nice look. And then I'm just wearing my Converse with those for a nice casual look. Hopefully we'll see some fireworks out there later. showering right now and then I'll get ready for bed and then we're honestly just gonna watch fireworks from the hotel and get to bed wake up early and we have all day to do stuff tomorrow so it needs to focus you need to focus. I'm hungry. <laughs> Gotta show them what we look like. Show the camera. What we look like for our walking <laughs> Wait, did walking you get the part where I said you need to focus on hunger? <laughs> yes. <laughs> That's comedy. <laughs> Ready to go? About my little baby, the lady is mine. We're ready to go for breakfast. Peanut butter hot chocolate. Something like that. It looks literally like a dessert. Pistachio latte. It looks like it's gonna be super good. I think that's pistachio cream and that's espresso. I love anything pistachio, so this is probably gonna be good. Ooh. Green eggs and ham. <laughs> this looks so cool. It's literally like Dr. Seuss. Potatoes, English muffins. Oh my god, they gave me like fresh jelly. You got a skillet. <laughs> good. That's really good hot sauce. Really? That looks really like, good. Here. And pancakes. And our drinks. <laughs> it's very good. It's hot, but it tastes. The flavor is nice. I just wasn't expecting it to be that hot. Our breakfast food review from Yolk. Coffee is yolk, good. Yolk, yolk. Pistachio latte. Get again if I go. <laughs> yeah, ten out of ten. I, I like it. it and like coffee. green eggs and ham scramble. Like yeah, Dr. Seuss was great. He so got had green eggs a and ham. skillet. How was the skillet? Uh, skillet, 10 out of 10. I'm not a big skillet guy, but I liked it. <clears throat> pancakes tasted like high quality Coney pancakes. Although there's not Coney's anywhere but like Michigan. There's so people. It's like don't the land of the Coney's. 
Yeah, I know. At, Coney you know, pancakes are good. You know what's weird? These pancakes are great. It's called Coney English Island. English muffin was very fresh, amazing. I would definitely go there again. 10 out of 10. We, Detroit's got Coney Islands. Like, I get that. We're the Coney people. But how come, what about Coney Island? Like, in New York? There's a Coney Island. No, does Coney Island have Coney Islands? I'm saying there's a Coney Island. Like, an island that's literally called Coney. Yeah, I don't think it's an island. I think it's just like a part of New York. But yeah, there is a place called Coney Island. Oh. Does, is Michigan literally the only one with Coney Islands? Yeah. That's insane. What is your impression of Indianapolis so far? It's good. Stadium. I've been here. He has not. Stadium, really? That's your impression? Why? Okay, Indiana's one of those teams I don't hate them, but I, I don't necessarily like them. I'm not so, talking about the state, I'm talking about the city. It's cool. <laughs> A man of little words. Your it's cool basically means he likes it. Yeah. It's like a small town city, but also like a cool industrial town vibe, which I like. I've only ever been here for gymnastics. I've never been able to just actually go and walk around everywhere. Mm. Okay, finish our walk towards the hotel. Went to the mall for Kelvin. I am the only one that's bought anything Forever 21, but they had such amazing deals, I got like $100 worth of stuff for 30, so worth it. updated outfit because you look good in your new shorts I bought you. <laughs> hey now we match. Let's go look. They're only 15 bucks that's pretty good or like 13 or something and now we're matchy matchy. Why do we always do this on accident? Oh my god, our sandals, our little light blue shorts, white shirts. <laughs> All right, run. Get your exercise. No way I'm Stairs running that. <laughs> no way I'm running that. Definitely getting our steps in.
on the canal with lime Italian ice and tequila. Amazing, better than margarita, I swear to God. And the boy under 21 here got a water. Smart. Couple days. Smart. Smart water. This is so good. Finish walking down the canal. It won't focus. Tequila is my absolute favorite liquor. Makes you dumb. Makes me smart. It does not make me dumb. Yeah, it does. So good. How good do you think it's gonna be? Have you ever had a fried Oreo? I've been to a fair before. <laughs> I've never had a fried Oreo. You barely bit it, ate it yet. On top. Mm. How have you never had a fried Oreo? Like, oh, yeah, good, good. How you Recording. What's your opinion? First time fried Oreo. Definitely turn on the time. No regrets having this before dinner. <laughs> Chicken tacos and rice and beans. Cheese curd burger. <laughs> that sauce is so good though. I gotta get you eating the burger. I don't even know how to eat it. I think I need to like... <laughs> I have to like squish it down. <laughs> Hello, we're back at our hotel after our long day, but we just ate. Oh my god, I just almost said breakfast. I'm so tired. We've done so much walking. My feet hurt like hell. I wore sandals i can show you but i wore those white sandals and i swear to god it hurt my feet so bad usually i just wear them outside or like to the beach or something and i didn't realize how bad that they would hurt wearing them all day so i'm just laying in bed now calvin's showering again because he showers every single day and i don't wash my hair every day so i just body shower we ate dinner at this bar and grill called brothers and it was a pretty quick walk like five to ten minutes and super super cool atmosphere has like a bar and grill inside and a like outdoor patio area with like an entertainment vibe like there's like big game like connect four and cornhole and stuff like that so that you can like have a drink but also play games and stuff like that but there was only one server in the whole restaurant. I don't know what happened. And she was running around like a chicken with its head cut off. Every single table, literally you could see that she wanted to like cry. And she like took a long time to come over to our table after like giving us our drinks and everything and like ordering for her bill. And me and Calvin were like, do not worry. We've worked in a restaurant. We know how this happens. Like it is not your fault. We see you busting your ass around and we are going to pay you in cash. So. She was super nice. We were nice to her, gave her a nice tip. So, highly recommend the place, but I don't know if it's always understaffed or what. Food was delicious. I had street tacos. Kelvin had a burger per usual, and the deep fried Oreos. So freaking good. I have never had a deep fried Oreo before. I know crazy, but so good. We had half of them for appetizer and half of them for dessert, and it was amazing. But. 
highly recommend that place. Everywhere we've eaten so far has been phenomenal. Honestly, just kind of like random little spots that we found, but I am going to get ready for bed in the next five minutes and then go to bed. It is only 9.20, but we want to wake up early tomorrow and head out to breakfast, walk around this little neighborhood, and then go to the NCAA Hall of Champions, and then we're going to head home because we actually have somewhere to be later in the afternoon tomorrow, and I need to go feed our dogs when we get home because my parents are camping all week, and I will be the only one there. So, busy day tomorrow. We want to wake up early, so we're going to head to bed now, but I will see you then. It's so humid. It's literally fogging up. We were supposed to go out earlier in the day, but Sam, I woke up late. Sam snooze the alarm. <laughs> I always do that. We're going to breakfast. Wild eggs. Check out our hotel. Future wild... reference, park and parking structures that have a cheaper parking than hotels do. Because we paid $17 eggs. an hour instead of $32. For $17 a day instead of $32. They're wild because they're platypus eggs. See you at breakfast. Breakfast review. My stomach is huge. We got waters to go because we're stupid and we didn't bring any waters for this whole entire trip. So we are highly dehydrated. But I got eggs benedict. Kevin got cinnamon roll skillet and sausage. That was the second best cinnamon roll we have had. Shout out to Emerson. Shout out to Emerson, AKA my best friend. And she's an amazing cook slash baker slash everything. And her cinnamon roll is the best we have ever had in our entire lives. So that was a second. Not even a close second, just second. My eggs benedict was very classic eggs benedict. And now we are walking to our final event of the final trip. Final destination. Which is the NCAA Hall of Champions.